Welcome to part four of Ship a Ton. App Jam by Community Kit officially started today and it is August 1st and Ship a Ton officially started today. So that means you can now ship your app. I won't be doing that yet. I still have like a little, little-ish bit to do. So I will show you some of that. But before I show you that, be sure to sign up at gobubbles.app. That is where I am going to officially like release it uh, via like a newsletter of like, this is the app on the app store. Because I'm saying, screw it, we're not doing a beta test. We are just going straight to the app store with complete minimum functionality. Let's go. So to use Bubbles, you have to be able to log in. So you have to log in to the different kinds of discourse clients that you have. For example, like the Swift forums or the Code with Chris forums or even Discourse's official Discourse. Yeah. So first what we're looking at is how we log in using different uh, authentication, like email and password or GitHub. So first we have to figure that out, but as I started working through that, I thought about how would you use the platform when you're not logged in? So when you're not logged in, for example, to the Swift forums, you can actually see a bunch of different things. Oh no, now we need to figure out what it's actually going to look like. So what kind of experience do you want on iOS, on Mac OS, on iPad OS, what does that experience look like for using this with forums, for example? What does that actually look like for you within this native experience? So that's the question I've been attempting to figure out for the last for the last couple hours. And so I wanna ask you that and also ask some of my friends, what does this experience look like in a native platform? Be sure to sign up to gogobubbles.app to follow along. See you next time.